Elder Franklin D. Richards said if all the saints could be present together during conference to hear what was spoken, it would be far easier to control and govern the people throughout the territory. He dwelt considerably on the necessity of union to enable us to accomplish what lay before us to be done. We needed much culture and education, and if we endured in the councils and the servants of God, our union would increase. The union that was wanted was that which united us in the Spirit of God and prompted us to keep God's holy will. Divisions, discord, and wickedness were becoming very general among the inhabitants of the earth. Let us be united in these valleys, in the building of temples, by carrying out faithfully the law of tithing, which God gave to Joseph Smith about eight years after the organization of the church. Let us put away the evils of the world and cultivate the pure principles of the gospel, and be willing to labor in our sphere in doing the will of God. Let us practice our secret prayers and all other duties devolving upon us. That we might see the work of God prosper was his earnest prayer and desire.